All right. It's that time, bruh. Y'all know what time it is. Go loco. Go loco. El Basardo. El Basardo. Y'all know what time it is. We doing the El Basardo look into the tank and spank. Let's get it. All them haters, I left them for the work. We the gospel that I preach. Welcome to the church. All right, man, let's go over El Basardo. Uh, one of the most aggressive tanks there is in the game that just just won't leave you alone. Get off me, damn it. Get off me. Let's look at his abilities. So the first ability that El Basardo has in his passive is life support. All right, provides protection shields powered up by damage from machetes and specials. Okay. Shields, baby. Shields. Think that way. All right. All shields all day long. All right. His next ability that is super, super good is Leap of Faith. All right. This is how this is how El Basardo sticks to people and won't leave people alone and harasses people. And he just keeps coming back and he just won't get away from me. And he just keeps bullying me and he just keeps slicing me. And then he does this spin shit and he just won't leave me alone. But basically, Leap of Faith is how he's getting to you. Because Leap of Faith, when he jumps on you, he stuns you. You're stuck in place. There's no way. You can't do anything. And he just keeps welling on you. And keeps welling on you. But he's not doing damage. It's really not him doing all the damage. It's his teammates doing all the damage. No whooping your ass. You didn't even realize that. All right. Um, next ability up, we have Death Spiral. Becomes a sword tornado. Literally, he spins around over and 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 over again. And sometimes it seems like forever because he's already on top of you and he just keeps spinning and he's hitting everybody and he's not taking damage because he's got a shield. It's very stressful. Okay. And the next ability we have up is empower still life from nearby enemies granting energy to life support shields. But we missed the part stills life from nearby enemies granting energy to life support shields so the more enemies he have around him the more support shield he gets all right so now let's talk about supers overlord um are unbreakable i think a lot of people prefer I think a lot of people prefer Unbreakable. I I, I I don't know. It's just a little mixture in between. You can do anyone. Your life support, basically overload. Your life support overload dealing consistent damage to nearby enemies. So, it's it's just basically it's his radius that goes around him. He'll, he'll say something like, Yo, Kano Taco Bell! And then all motherfuckers will be like, some spinning lightning around him and is healing and hitting everybody. He's spinning. He's on top of you and stuff like that. And this is just a joke, by the way. Um, but yeah, and that's usually what happens and stuff. Unbreakable pretty much is a cool ability because it allows you not to be killed. So it allows you to stay in the fight longer. Unbreakable cannot be killed for five seconds. Dealing damage extends the duration. So the biggest thing I see people do is I'm like, yo, he just popped Unbreakable. Stop attacking him. And then El, and El Basardo is just looking at them like, no, hit me, hit me, hit me, hit me, hit me. Yes, you. Yes, hit me. Everybody hit me. And then this shit goes on for freaking forever. Next thing you know, he's at full health because he's getting healed. Wow. Okay? So, uh, yeah. So, dealing damage extends the duration, consumes life support shields when activated for bonus time, and grants shields at the end based on damage done. Okay? Stop hitting him when he alts. Please. Please, for the love of God, stop. All right, now let's talk about his mods. <laughs> Find each other. All right, so I just have a default on him right now. Nothing special. Battle hard increases basic health by 80 HP. And then we have spin to win. Uh, basically increases death spiral damage by 50% and supercharge and power generates an additional 40 HP base shield. All right. Uh, these are the abilities for him. We got death from above increases leap of faith damage by 25% The leap of faith already hits hard if you can land it, bro and increasing the damage is like boom It's nasty. All right 
uh, increases leap of faith stun duration by 0.5 seconds. Uh, Spiral Guard gains 10% damage resistance while casting Death Spiral. And then Pass, Pass Adobo increases Death Spiral duration by 2 seconds. Twinkle Toes gain 15% movement speed while casting Death Spiral. That means it's a moving motherfucking tornado. Okay? Alright, Second Wind gains 115 HP or more shields when Unbreakable ends. And extra capacity increases life support maximum shield capacity by 150 HP. Uh, 9,000 mwah! Reduces life support shield decay rate by 50%. Alright. Cheat Death increases Unbreakable's duration by 2 seconds. Shock and O. Uh, Shock and Owl increases overload damage by 20%. Ouch. 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 Alright. Storm Rider increases overload duration by 2.5 seconds. Short Circuit increases empowered damage by 50%. Pain Suppressor gains 3.5 damage resistance for each enemy hit with empowered. The effect lasts 10 seconds and can stack up to 4 times. This is a good ability. A good mod. Oh my gosh. Broken. Alright, Quick Charge. Increases life support shield generates from attacks by 30%. El Salto reduces leap of faith cooldowns by 1.5 seconds. Stand your ground. Gain 25% damage resistance while stunned or frozen. What a bruiser. What what a bruiser. Alright. Rampage gains 4% extra damage for each kill or assist. The effect lasts 45 seconds to stack up to 4 times. No! <laughs> Golly! Alright. Blood Rage deals 1% extra damage for every 5% health missing. And then Berserker deals 1% extra damage for every 25 shield currently generated. Alright, y'all. Listen. That's your boy. El Basardo. Yo, Kato Taco Bell. He will whoop your ass. Alright? Beast. Beast. Can stay in a fight for a long period of time. Listen, he is built to last, bro. And he will whoop that ass. Guys, post your mob builds below. Like, how many of you guys are El Basardo fans? This, this is a true tank, man. This is a true tank. Like, you can't get him off you. Oh, my gosh. He is very fun to play, too. Um, post your mod builds below, y'all. Um, until the next video, I'll see you guys next time. Make sure you like and subscribe. I'm out. All them haters, I left them for the work. Keep the gospel that I preach, y'all. Welcome to the church. church, church.